Brazil's fashion industry is almost exclusively white, as are its icons. For instance, Gisele Bündchen, one of the highest paid supermodels in the world, or Jesus Luce, who has found fame as Madonna's toy boy. But that doesn't gel with the reality. Half of Brazil is descended from Africa, making it the biggest black population in Latin America. Now black Brazilian models hope the quota system will turn the tide. There's just 10 percent of us getting work. I think there's really racism. That's what we're trying to show. But the new rule that 10 percent of the models must be black isn't enough, anti-discrimination groups say. We think 10 percent is very little, and there shouldn't have to be quotas for black models. We want more to see black producers, black stylists, people who work in fashion generally, to be more a part of the market. Backstage, other models support the initiative, even if they don't see a big change coming. Unfortunately, even in the 21st century, there is bias. I think they have been suffering a bit, but they've managed to carve out a space for themselves. I think the girls are doing well. The reality is that while a small step may have been taken against discrimination on the runway, Brazil as a society still has a long way to go for racial equality.